Welcome back to the Crypto Gorilla YouTube channel. So I know a lot of you aren't into Cardano yet, but I am super bullish on it, both as a blockchain and CNFTs. So today we're gonna take a look at up and coming games on Cardano that I feel have a lot of potential. As usual, I'm not a financial advisor. Everything I say in this video is just my opinion and you should always do your own research before buying or selling anything. Also, I'm giving away point one Ethereum to my subscribers when I reach 20,000. If you want to find out how to win, be sure to stay until the end of the video. The first one on our list is the one I am most bullish about, and that's Cornucopias. Cornucopias is a free to play metaverse NFT based game that offers people multiple ways to make money, such as play to earn, build to earn and learn to earn. They recently released this demo, which is an Unreal Engine 4. The official game is an Unreal Engine 5. And this shows off your home bubble that every player will receive for free when they start the game. And while you will be able to purchase land in common zones, it's cool that every player will get a space that they can hang out with friends, build and upgrade. So as I said, there's gonna be various ways you can earn in this game. The first is going to be play to earn, where you can go out, complete quests, as well as play mini games. The second is by making blueprints in your home bubble. And then while using the raw materials you earned while playing the game, you can build them and then use them to either decorate your home bubble or sell them on the open market. The Third way is learn to earn, where they are already partnering with in real life companies to create different facilities where you can go and learn about different topics and earn while doing it. So other than your home bubble, there will be different themed zones such as the Western zone, the Samurai zone, and the Farm Life zone, as well as the Mega City, which will have different districts. You will be able to purchase or earn land in these zones, as well as different buildings in the villages or in the districts of the Mega City. Now this is where the fourth way to earn comes in, and this is something I'm personally going after because owning one of these establishments is basically like owning a business in real life. Players who come to your village will need you in order to complete tasks and you're going to benefit off of their work. As for the blockchain, while this is built on Cardano, they intend to make it cross-chain and collaborate with many existing and up-and-coming metaverses. Now there is a ton more to explain. I do plan on making a dedicated video to this project as I am very bullish on it. However, for now, I just wanted to put it on your radar as the land sale is coming up in a few weeks and I personally plan on buying as many as I can afford because I strongly believe in the future of this project. Now land is expected to be between $100 and $5,000 depending on what you buy and they are currently projecting to launch in early December. Now land will be available for everyone to buy so even if you're in the US or in the UK you will have an opportunity to get in. As for the game they will have a very limited browser version available in Q1 of 2022 and the main game is set to have its initial release in Q4 of 2022. Next is another metaverse game called Pabia. Now there is a lot less information on this project than there is for Cornucopias. However, that did not stop me from buying land during their initial sale, which despite being a stealth launch, they managed to sell out 29,000 NFTs before anyone knew what this project was or what the map looked like. So of the 29,000 different pieces, there were 9,000 that were split into estates, which are made up of nine connected parcels. And then in the center of the map, you have the spawn zone. Now for this game, they do intend on making it a VR compatible experience and they did say they will have a demo to show in early 2022. If we take a look at their roadmap, the second sale that was originally planned for early 2022 has been pushed up to this November. In December, they will have a Pavia token snapshot and an airdrop to all landowners. And finally, in Q3 of 2022, they have their first ever event in the Pavia Plaza. Now this roadmap was recently updated. However, if we turn to their Twitter, they did mention that they will elaborate on it sometime this week. Now, during the first sale, the original price was 39 ADA. And as you can see, they're currently above 400 ADA, which is over a 10X return. Now, unfortunately, their original sale was not open to the USA or the UK. So I assume that it's gonna be the same restrictions this time around. So this is also a project that I'm super bullish on. I did flip one just to cover the cost of the other ones that I purchased. Now, unfortunately, it was the day before they released these 3D images on their Twitter and the floor has pumped but I will be looking into purchasing some during the next sale. The next game that I'm personally looking to invest in is Equine. Now this is a racehorse management game that will have its first bundle sale in December. So in this game, you will be able to race, breed, customize, and trade your horses. Horses will have a life cycle of four periods. The first stage being young, where their base stats will grow very quickly. The second stage is adult, where their base stats will slow down, but their training stats will grow quicker. And this is where I assume your horse will perform 
form at its peak. Next is senior, where the stats are going to begin to decline. And finally, there's ghost, where your horse is going to move on and you will be able to get a trophy based on their championship legacy, as well as receive a brand new horse. Now, the pace at which your horses are going to go through this life cycle is equivalent to one horse year per month. So the entire life cycle is going to be 18 months. The horses will be the main component in this game, and you'll also receive a jockey, which will be used as a modifier, as well as skins, which I assume are purely cosmetic. Breeding will also be a very important aspect in this game, and you will be able to use your horse to rent out to others for breeding and use that as another form of generating income. Now the team for this project is quite stacked. Fahad is known throughout the Cardano space as his wallet has over 3,800 NFTs and over 100 of them are space buds, which have a floor of over 3,800 ADA. So the NFTs for this are going on sale in December and they will be bundled. Now a bundle consists of a horse, a jockey, and a random skin of a horse or a jockey. There will be a supply of 10,000 bundles and they're going to be 250 ADA each. Now it is important to note that the game will not be ready until Q3 of 2022, but this is the first of its kind on Cardano and I am hopeful that they can have a similar success to something like Zed Run or D-Race. Last on our list is Dinoverse. So I originally joined this Discord when it was very bare bones and I did not think much of it. They were selling this membership, which looks absolutely amazing, but I wasn't sure if I wanted to invest. They then started to release the 3D animated dinosaurs that they were building and they really caught my attention. So while there currently is no game for the moment, they do intend on adding gamification later on in 2022. If we look on stage four of their roadmap, you can see that they want to make an online metaverse, which will be a place that you can show off and interact with your dinosaurs, as well as a battle arena where you can battle your dinosaurs against others. They also mentioned they plan on adding weapons, accessories, and advanced attributes, which will be used in the battle arena. If we jump back to today, they are designing a ton of different dinosaurs, starting with the T-Rex collection, and they will then have a Raptors series, dinosaur egg, Eggs, triceratops, pterodactyls, and so on. Now these are more on the expensive side of 125 ADA each. However, they are very exclusive as this isn't a 10,000 NFT drop. Now I did end up purchasing a membership as well as one of the T-Rexes. I personally love how they look. The rare ones are fully animated. They even have some mech ones that look a lot like Zoids, and these can be interacted with in your wallet. So I'm just thinking ahead of the future, being in my dinosaur park in VR and being able to interact with my dinosaur. So this NFT drop is ongoing. So if you are interested in their up and coming drops, be sure to hop in their Discord because throughout the next year, they're going to be having a ton of different sales. That does it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, be sure to give it a big thumbs up, hit that subscribe button. It really helps the channel grow. And the more of a channel grows, the more I can give away. Speaking of which, I'm giving away 0.1 Ethereum to my subscribers when I hit 20,000 subscribers. If you want to qualify to win, you have to subscribe to my channel, follow me on Twitter, retweet my pinned tweet, and tag one friend in the comments of my pinned tweet. If you aren't already subscribed to my channel, would you kindly hit that subscribe button, smash that bell notification. Thank you for watching the Crypto Gorilla. Peace.